I may be late, but I always show up to the function. Let's review and roast Emmy's 2024 red carpet. Sure enough, we got my good sis Io in the black leather Louis V time dress. You look fucking amazing. Goddamn, thank you for coming. The shape, the seaming, the, the cut, the hem, the hair, the skin, the everything. Fucking thank you. Goddamn, thank you. Selena Gomez and it's Oscar de la Renta. Good day, ma'am. Go the fuck home. No fucking thank you. No fucking thank you whatsoever. Go the fuck home. Go. Go. Jennifer Coolidge in Etro. I don't hate it. You know, it's Jennifer Coolidge. So it's one thing about it in two things for certain. That bitch can do no wrong for me, like low key, like honestly. And I'm not even mad at it. She looked comfortable. She looked cute. She looked like Jennifer motherfucking Coolidge. So thank you for coming, babe. Jessica Williams looks fucking darling in this black and white two-tiered Rodarte dress. I am enjoying this. I'm enjoying this a lot. The shoe, on the other hand, I could could do without the shoe. The shoe is just not hitting for me, but you know, that's neither here nor there. The dress, the dress is what we're talking about. That is the conversation piece. That and her face. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, darling. Gorgeous. Thank you for coming. Courtney and Travis Walker, if y'all don't twin y'all asses the fuck off my screen, fuck off. Fuck off, I ain't spending no time on this. Go on some damn way. Go to hell. Suki Waterhouse came in looking kind of sexy with her baby bump in the Valentino red. I don't hate it. I think she looks beautiful in the face. The color's nice on her. It's interesting, but she's pregnant. So, you know, like, show it off, you know. Go off, sis. I like it. Thank you for coming. Jenna Ortega, don't you look sweet? You just look darling, my good little sis. I like it. I'm not really a big deal fan like that, but this... This is giving me all of the vibes and all of the feels. It's ethereal, but then it's not. It's short, but then it's not. It's long, but then it's not. It's cute. I like the hair. I like the dress. Thank you for coming, babe. Kudos. Lueve, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this, bitch? I thought this was a goddamn sandwich bag on her chesticles for a second. I don't know who Aubrey Plaza is, but Aubrey, you need to not do this shit ever again. You look like a very sweet girl. I'm sure you're very fucking nice, but this is a no fucking thank you. Good day, man. Issa Rae and Pamela Rollin, you look like a sexy ass feather duster, just embellished and and just just floating. You look like a beautiful ostrich, just galloping down the gray carpet. I guess I don't know. Um, it's something. It's cute. It's giving me very expensive caftan. It's reading very much Las Vegas showgirl in retirement. I'm not mad. I like it. Thanks for coming, baby. Sarah Snook looks great. Got this red Vivian Westwood number going on. I don't hate it. Not my favorite. I don't love it. I don't hate it. Thank you for coming. You, you, you showed up. And you're dressed. Oh. Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann. Lisa Ann. I don't know who to blame. I don't know who is at fault. But this Greta number is not hitting. This ain't it. This ain't it, my good sis. Like, these, these carpets, you've been looking real fucking questionable. And I'm starting to think it is based off of your taste level. Because there's no reason for you to hire somebody who's going to put you in that. Do you have a stylist or do you do this shit on your own? I have questions. I have so many questions. I have multiple concerns. Please don't do this again. Please don't do this again. Thank you for coming. Goodbye. Good day, ma'am. Christina Ricci in this black St. Laurent. I think she learned a lesson. I think she learned her lesson after the fucking travesty that was that look on the Golden Globes carpet. That fucking shit show of a dress look combination situation this is how you fucking do it this is what this is what works this hits this hits so nice and it looks so good on you it's basic it's a basic ass dress ain't nothing special about it but you fill it out well and you carry it you look great fucking thank you Tyler. one thing about it and two things is for fucking certain you are on punishment go to your fucking room we do not do dng no doce and gabbana will be tolerated not over here not in this motherfucking household and not in this motherfucking lifetime. They don't fuck with us, so we don't fuck with them. Don't do this again. Don't ever do this again. I'm going to give you this one motherfucking pass because maybe you did not fucking know. But you better learn. You better learn. Go, go on, sit down somewhere. Go on. Go on your room. Go on. Nope. Beatrice looks fucking fantastic. I love this. Now, this is how you do black and red. This works. This is cool. It's interesting. It's not too much, but it's enough, and it's it's pretty. It's not the most shapeliest thing you've ever seen, but you don't have to show off too much to do something impactful. The Armani Privé is not always my favorite thing to look at, but sometimes they come out with some really solid ass looks. And this is a solid. And it looks like there is a tool overlay over top of this, I'm assuming, sequence fabric. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. You look great, Beatrice. Thank you for coming. 
it is so much red going on on this red carpet. That's not even a red carpet, but I digress. Abby Elliott and Alexander McQueen. I love me some McQueen. I love me some McQueen down to the ground and up to the sky. I love McQueen, but I do not like this. There's some going on in the chesticle area that's just not hitting. The titties is the titties is is not sitting. They they look sad. They look depressed. It's gonna be a no. But thank you for coming. Laverne Cox went into the archives and pulled out a vintage Terry Mugler. And one thing that I can say, you look fantastic. Look goddamn drop dead gorgeous, bitch. I'm not even mad. Not even mad at you by a long shot. Thank you for showing up and showing the girls how to do the carpet. Thank you. I fucks with it. Thank you for coming, babe. Simona Tabasco. This is, this is fucking lovely. This is lovely. This 2D floral look like stickers or some shit. This is hot. And this little Marnie piece is nice. I like this. At first, I thought I was going to have to cut your ass out because I thought this was Dolce and Gabbana. But it's not. So we good. We good over here. You look great. You look fucking beautiful. I love this. <laughs> Thank you for fucking coming. J. Smith Cameron in this green Christian Siriano gown. I don't know what it is about Christian Siriano, but he knows how to age a woman down to a T. Like, just make you look as matronly as he possibly can. I feel like that is his mission and goal in life. Why the fuck you do this to this woman? Why you do this to her? She did not deserve this. She's look like a sweet little old blonde haired lady. She ain't deserve this shit. Christian, go to hell. Go to hell. I don't blame nobody else but you. Because you made this bullshit. Just fucking stop. Just goddamn stop. Hang it up. Stop it. Stop doing this shit to these people. You fucking rude. You rude as hell. You rude as a motherfucker. Go to hell and gasoline draws and burn, you rude motherfucker. Why you do this to this woman? Oh, grinds my gears. Rhea Seahorn in the chartreuse Naeem Khan dress. Pretty. I guess uh, I love the embellishment. You know, it reads into this culture. It's cute. I, thank you for coming, babe. Goodbye. Next. Nisi. Nisi Poo, is that you? I almost couldn't tell because the yabos was yabbing, baby. The chesticles are up, out, and lifted, and you look good while you're doing it. This dress is great. She's in a black, uh, multi fabric Greta Constantine. I am not upset. Bitch, you better smile. You better smile hard because you look good. The work has paid off for you in that dress. Thank you for fucking coming. Yelena something or another. I don't know your name. I don't know who is who, actually. I don't know who is who. Um, the dress is interesting. It's not boring. I don't know if I like it or if I hate it or if I love it. I'm not really fucking sure. So thank you for confusing me. Thanks for coming. Catherine High and Dior Hulk Couture. Who the fuck do I blame for this one? Who the fuck is responsible for this bullshit? She looks so fucking uncomfortable. She look at her smirk on her face. She trying to push past the pain. This is upsetting to me and my homegirls. Don't ever do this to her ever again in life. This is for somebody auntie mama. Not for, like stop playing. This is for a luncheon. This is like bitch. This is anything but here. Like where are we going? What are we doing? Fuck is you saying? What are you wearing, bitch? No, no fucking thank you. Go to hell. Chris Parfetti in BMC Studios. I really don't give a fuck about the suit. I just wanted to pull him up because come on, swoop a doop. You better swoop that motherfucking hair. Them follicles is laid, died, and pressed to the side, bitch. Come on, sister. You look cute. I ain't mad at you, sir. Go ahead and do you. Thanks for coming. Lauren Ambrose. Bitch, you're not fooling nobody. That is a caftan. That is a poolside piece with a sash around your waist. Fuck off. No fucking thank you. Zena Roberts. Is that Dolce & Gabbana? A bitch, go to hell. Good day. Look at this sweet little man, this little precious soul. He just looks so precious. His brush is a little hot. He looks questionable, but he came out, and you know what? He at least tried, and I cannot even be mad at you, Brian. I cannot be mad at you, Mr. Cox. You could have been doing anything else in the world, and you decided to come out to the Emmys on that night of the night, and you know what? Thank you. I can't say nothing else, but thank you. Thank you for coming out with your gentle self. Mm -hmm. Bless his heart. Charmaine, Charmaine. You look great. I don't, I don't really understand what's going on with the dress, but I, I don't even want to understand it. I like it. It's, it's cool. Like, it's different. It, it's got some it's got some personality. And that's all that matters. You look great. Thank you for coming. Sophie Thatcher, what in the green hills, rolling pastures is this bullshit? St. Laurent, I have questions for you because why the fuck did you make this in the first place? This neckline looks so fucking bold. This looks so fucking bold. Is this for like a bitch with fucking broad shoulders or something? Something is just so wrong about this that it is criminal. Criminal offense. 
this is this should never have been made in the first place maybe it's is it supposed to be off the shoulders or some shit either way the dress is fucking boring the dress is fucking boring the color is beautiful the dress is boring your hair weird brush it no fucking thank you go to hell good day carrie o'neill what the fuck is happening what the fuck is this? I don't even know what fabric this is. I don't even know what the fuck I'm looking at right now. And why the fuck you got this cut out right under your armpit? None of this makes sense. It just looks so fucking uncomfortable. Bitch, you can't even lift your arm if you wanted to. Go to hell with your uncomfortable ass. Joel Kim Booster and Todd Snyder. It's not black. It's not black. I, it's brown. It's, it's a chocolate brown. I, it's a difference. It's, it's cute. It's something. You know, you look, you look uncomfortable. But the suit looks nice. So thank you for that. Next. Courtney Eaton and Jason Wu. I want to say you eating it so bad. It's not a bad dress. I don't necessarily think. It's just, the ruffle placement for me is just strange. Like this crisscross applesauce all on your titty. I don't know about that. And you got this ruffle going down the center of your titty. Don't know about that. And then you got it going down your thighs. Uh, that's not that bad. And I don't mind it on, on the, the sleeve situation. It's not the worst, but it could be better. I'll say thank you for coming. Anthony Anderson in Etro. I'm not even mad. I'm not mad at you at all. You try something different. You got this blazer with the floral embroidery on it. And you got the flood ready pants going on, giving a little sexy, trying to show off a little ankle bit. I'm not mad at you, my boy. Thanks for coming. Alex Burstein, Burstein, Burr, whatever the fuck. Burn this dress. Burn that shit to a crisp. Why the fuck did you put this on? Who hates you? Who hates you? Do you hate yourself? Did you choose this? Somebody in your camp hates you? Somebody dislikes you like a motherfucker. Because there is no way in fuck I'm going to let my client, my homie, my bestie, myself walk out in this bullshit. What the fuck is happening? Fuck going on, fuck going on, girl. Go to hell. You already dressed for it, bitch. You dressed for the hell fiesta. Fuck off. Next, we got Garcelle in this black Badgley Mishko one shoulder thingy my Bobby or whatever the fuck. <sighs> One thing about Garcelle is I love her down, but she loves to find a way to look cheap. I don't know what it is on her taste level, but she finds the most unattractive, uninteresting, boring, but extra ass fucking dresses and items to put on her body. And I just never understood why. I never understood it. I would never understand. You know what I mean? Like, you know, if that's what you like, then girl, you do you. But I hate it. No fucking thank you. Go to hell. Taylor Jenkins, did you fucking try? What the fuck are you even wearing right now? Bitch, did you have just a sweater over a ball gown or a ball skirt, whatever the fuck you want to call it? No fucking thank you. No fucking thank you, ma'am. You can kick rocks, no socks. Fuck off. Good day, ma'am. Bella Ramsey, oh my fucking gosh. Oh my gosh, is hell about to freeze over. Thank you. You actually put on something presentable to walk down the red carpet in. This looks great. Whoever made this decision did you right. They did you fucking right and did you all the way good. You look great. I like this. I like the color combination. I love this green with the red turtleneck. P oh, it's great. It's fucking great. Thank you for coming. Finally, you can stay. If Donald Glover don't look like somebody, Graham Graham, I don't know who the fuck does in this black velvet floral embroidered suit set. No fucking thank you. And bitch, do you got on Mary Jane's? Go to hell, Donald. Stop. Everybody can't be different. Everybody can't be different. Because this, <laughs> this is a fucking, what were you thinking? If what were you thinking was a person? What's going on? Fuck off. But thank you for coming. Amy Pooler looks radiant in this burgundy sequence high split column dress number. I'm not hating. It ain't my favorite thing I've ever seen in my life. I can definitely say it's not my favorite thing ever in the world, but it's definitely cute. It's definitely something. She definitely looks great. Thank you for coming. Now, Rachel Brosnahan, on the other hand, hit all the marks. She hit all the marks, checked all the boxes. Balances are in order. This is nice. I like this. I love the color on her. This definitely gives Versace. Versailles at its finest. This looks like a Versace piece. I love this. Thank you, Donatella, and thank you, Rachel. Rachel, you've been killing the game, bitch. <laughs> you've been showing the girls how to do it, so I'm gonna give you all your props. Like you've been you've been working it, so thanks for coming. Siraji's looking fucking fantastic in this little high split purple Versace Atelier number. I am not upset. She got her hair high and she is standing strong, and you look great while you're doing it. Thank you for fucking coming. Y'all did that one. Alfie Fuller. I don't know who made this dress. Again, giving very much. Kinsignetta, pretty, pretty princess. 
I am a fucking unicorn, tea party, childhood, nostalgia. If that's what you wanted, that's what you were going for. You have nailed the Disney princess. My problem is the hem of this dress. Did not nobody go down and look at how it's just all jagged and all over the fucking place? Nobody thought to check that. If you was going to hit it at a certain length, if you wanted to make a statement with this ankle cut tool dress. Bitch, you better make sure that shit is pristine. You better make sure that not a tool is out of place and that shit is travesty at its finest. You look happy, so I'll give you that. Am I? No, no, not at all. And I couldn't deal with all these goddamn bows in your head. That just also drives it to fucking child. You look like a big ass, grown ass toddler, but that is none of my business. Thank you for coming, girl. I guess. Here we go with another sexy feather duster. It's cute. I don't know who Desi is, but I know Pamela Rollin and you know, it's it's cute. It's like giving real expensive, sophisticated prom dress. Cute. Thanks. Thank you for coming, girl. Sophie decided to walk down the carpet naked. I mean, I'm not mad at you. You know, body positivity. You look fucking great. I love this flesh colored dress. I like the ruching on it. I like the drape. I think it's a little weird the way it falls mad flat right under the coochie mama. It, you could have did a little bit more down there or whatever. Like, just gave it a little more roosh, a little more vibrancy, a little more personality down towards the bottom. But overall, I mean, it works. So, thank you for coming. I'm not sure who this Robin woman is, and I'm not sure who made this dress. Oh, but it's a lot of a lot of going on on things that's like, I'm not really fucking sure. The, the breast cup's weird. This fucking sheer bony fucking, I don't know, I guess the, the, the drape over the hip and then the jet out on the other side. And then you got, it's, it's fucking tiered. And then you got a side train. What the fuck going on? And then you got the all fucking dacity to have a swoop over the hair. Babe, this is a whole lot of what the fuck at one time. And I say, no fucking thank you. Go to hell. Ariana, Ariana the voice. You're not fooling nobody. Y'all are not fooling no motherfucking body. Gonna put on this basic ass two piece and throw a sh fucking blaze on your shoulder? We over here shoulder resting still? No fucking thank you. This would have been cute for anything else, bitch. A luncheon, a bitch, the grocery store, going to the mailbox, anything. But you not fooling me. No fucking go home. And then while you at it after that, go to hell. Fuck. I am not familiar with Dominique Fishback. Sure, she's a lovely woman. Lovely girl. Love that. Love, love the melanin. You look great in the face. But this powder blue Mew Mew fucking Kinson Yetta dress, could have did without it. I could have totally did without this. We did not have to see this. Like, we could have went years upon days upon times, seconds, and months without you having to put this on your body. And maybe you wanted this fairy fairy princess moment or whatever. Like, maybe that's what the fuck y'all was going for. But, I mean, I guess. But, no, thank you. Thanks for coming up. Julia Lewis in this red Moschino. It's cute. I guess if that's what you like, you know what I'm saying? If that's what you wanted to put on your body or whatever, like that's cute. It's not terrible. You know what I'm saying? You're not the worst bitch on the carpet. I can tell you that right now because I've seen tears. I seen fucking tears. You, you say, you may live another day. Thank you for coming. Catherine Heigl came in looking like somebody auntie mama in this custom ream acro. Custom my ass. This is a JCPenney original. If I have ever laid eyes on one, don't fucking lie dead ass in my face. Don't play in my face with this bullshit. That's not custom. That's bullshit as fuck. Death, dead ass off the rack. Fuck out of here. Grandmama. Go to hell. Janelle. J it's not ugly. You know, like, this is just, like, something cute to just throw on and go. You know what I mean? Like, this is this is definitely, like, great for, like, I don't know, a ladies' luncheon, bitch. A fucking breast cancer awareness event. A gala or something. Something. But not for this. Not at the Emmys. No, thank you. It's cute, though. I mean, it's cute. I can't be like, I can't say that it's not cute. You know what I mean? Like you've been out of all of your co-stars. You've been rocking it out. I'm not even mad at you. I'm not even mad. Maybe you was just like, look, I don't feel like doing all this extra shit today. I just want to feel pretty and, you know, hit this carpet so I can get the fuck home. And you know what? I feel you. I ain't even mad. You look great, though. It's just a little boring for me. That's all. But love it. And I fuck with you. Fuck with you heavy, girl. Quinta, fire everybody, fire them all, fire them all, somebody needs to be smacked dead ass in their shit, I'm sure Dior, Hulk Couture, was going for this wrinkle, crinkle, uh, grandmother of the bride sort of dress, sort of vibe, sort of thing, sort of whatever the fuck it is, but no, somebody could have took a fucking steamer to this, 
There is no fucking way in hell if you walk down the carpet looking like you just pulled this out the back of the closet in a garbage bag. Like, bitch, no. No fucking thank you. Y'all doing my good sis very fucking wrong. And it's very fucking rude. And it's un uh, fucking appreciated. And it's unfucking appreciated. No fucking thank you. Ali Wong, go to hell. Just. It's like you do good and then you do terrible. It's no in between with you what so fucking ever. I don't know what the fuck is going on with this dress, but I fucking hate it. I hate the the shine and jazz and jam and all of it all. I hate this fucking floral print. I hate this sheer panel up on your decolletage. I hate everything. Fuck off. No fucking thank you. Ronald Gladden. It's not black. It's not black. Thank you for coming. Dame Joan Collins. She just looks precious just looks like a woman of age with style and grace i am not mad gloves and all you did it thank you for coming emma brooks McAllister in do long i do long to see another dress this is cute i'm not even mad uh, uh thank you i mean is it groundbreaking is it something i have never seen before no but it looks great on you it looks awesome i love the colorway i like how it kind of drape over your little hip bone it's cute it's something you did good, babe. Thanks for coming. Hannah, something or another came in this beautiful, beautiful sea foam green Marquesa prom dress. Beautiful. Thanks for coming, girl. Emma Ruffin, don't you look blessed and unfavored? Because this dress is so unfavorable. It is, it is comical at this point. What the fuck is this? The color is matronly. The fit of it is matronly. This shoulder situation, weird as fuck. This fucking, whatever the fuck that piece of fabric is on your hip. Why is that there in the first damn place? Not trying to give it personality. This looks terrible. Don't you ever do this again in your life or whoever put this on you. Fire them. No, thank you. Merritt Weaver. If you don't take your lackadaisical ass back to once you came from, what the fuck are you doing here? What are you here for? If you not going to try, why the fuck you come, bitch? You could have stayed home if you wanted to wear a goddamn pajama dress, bitch. Go home. Fuck off and burn in hell. Go on. Go on some fucking way. And piss me off. Michelle Bella, Bowman and Prada. Prada is always going to be obscure and a little bit off key. And in that regard, I'm not even mad at it. I expect something a little different from Prada. I don't know if you needed all of this. I don't know if you needed these gloves. I don't think you needed this headband. But that's none of my motherfucking business. If you like it, I love it, but bitch, I guess. Thank you for coming. Nah, Marion Hinkle, I'm not mad at you. I'm getting shoulder, I'm getting clavicle, and you got this liquid silver situation going on. You look statuesque. It's nice. Love that for you. Thanks for coming. Amber Mid Thunder. I don't know who the fuck she is, but she looks great in a Marquesa. This is cute. I like the, little, the bow shoulders. I like the little drape on the titty. I like the print. I like how it fades into a fucking sheer down towards the bottom so you can see the shoe. I like this. This is nice. Thank you for coming. Next. Carrie Russell came with her bed sheets tucked into her pencil skirt. It's cute. It's giving very much demure. Very much regal, bitch. I ain't mad at it. Give me a little shoulder. I'm not even mad at you, Catherine. Carrie, whatever your name is. Thank you for coming up. At this point, it is official. Natasha and Daniel, this this collaboration y'all got going is not fucking working. The Scaparelli dress is not hitting for me. It looks weird. I don't know what it is about it, but it's just not hitting the cause it's supposed to hit. No fucking thank you, but thank you for coming. Deuces. Good day. Ellen Pompeo, you stressing, y'all stressing me. Oh, what's going on? We already had this fucking Dior travesty, and now you got this on. It's like she had on the embellished familiar version of what the fuck you got on you went more sleek and chic and then she went extra can we fucking not just can we just fucking not no fucking thank you this is boo fucking boring go home maria bello bitch it's a no it is a fuck no what is happening again why the fuck do we keep doing all of these light colored items this gray tan whatever the fuck this top is silver shit with this white skirt and then you're gonna pair it with black shoes and a black bag go to fucking hell who the fuck is deciding these fucking choices who are making these decisions i need to see the docket obviously there's a docket going around that motherfuckers are reading off and they're giving motherfucking things that we need to push for the season and certain things don't need to be on this list because this this ain't working this ain't working for you and ain't working for nobody else in the past girl fuck off go to hell now, Cheryl, 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 the body is looking nice. You're looking stacked in all the right places. The face is giving the face that it needed to give for everybody to see. The dress, on the other hand, 
Um, I don't know about that one. It's the Christian. Go back to the drawing board on this. The, it's the lapel that really throw me the fuck off. Why are they so fucking big? Why are the lapels so damn big, so large and in charge? It's fighting for my attention. You got the yabos, and you got this lapel, and it's all in this satin, and you got the fucking fluff and duff coming out of her fucking kneecaps. It's a lot. And doing a little at the same time. I could do it out. But thank you for coming. Anthony Kerrigan looks cool, and he ain't even have to try that hard. See, fellas, it's not even that hard. Like, you don't have to do too much to do something impactful. He threw on a black button down, black slacks, black shoes, and just threw on a fucking cow print blazer. And just threw on a cow print blazer. Looks cool. Easy. Easy fucking peasy. Thank you, Anthony, for coming. <sighs> Tashina. 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 What the fuck? Are you okay? Are you okay? Because... What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Tashina. And whoever allowed you to walk out to you too. Go to hell. Respectfully. Why the fuck? Are you out here like this? What the fuck is even happening? I don't even know what the fuck I'm looking at. I see sequin pants. I see a leather cape. You got on a hat. Then you got on something else long. Is that a cardigan? Is that another shirt? Is it two shirts? Is it three shirts? It's so many things just happening that should not be happening right now. What the fuck is going on? I see motherfucking stomach. I see fucking neck meat. Like, what the fuck is happening? Go to hell. Go to hell. I'm done. Go to hell. Fuck off. Fuck all the way off. Don't you ever do this shit again in your fucking life. This, this is disrespectful to just to you, to us, to the culture, to everything. Don't be out here representing us in this bullshit. Go to hell. Gasoline draws. No fucking thank you. Priscilla Presley looks angry in her Chanel fit. She looks absolutely fucking pissed. Just like has the look of why the fuck am I here in this? Why am I here in this bullshit? Why? Out of all the things that you could pull from Chanel to put on this woman, that's what the fuck y'all chose. Who is making the decisions around this motherfucker? Somebody needs to have some talks. Serious ass conversations need to be had because there's no fucking way she should be walking out on fucking corporate in this bullshit. No fucking thank you. Bill Hatter looks fucking uncomfortable. I don't know what the fuck going on with this blazer, this little one button thing situation piece, but dog, not the move. Not the move for you and your shape. That's not hitting the way y'all thought it was going to hit. It looks like it's struggling to hold on, but they're like, don't do this to this man again. Don't ever do this to this man ever again. Like y'all did him real dirty in this fucking blazer. I don't like it. No, thank you. But thank you for coming. Charlie, 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 who the fuck is responsible for this? This looks wild. The proportions are fucking crazy. Why? Just fucking why? I Why? Who made these decisions? You look unsure yourself. You knew damn well this was not the move when you was walking to the car. You knew when you were in the dressing room. When they pulled this shit out, you knew. But you just let this shit happen. You just roll with the punches. You allow this shit to just go on for fucking forever. Why the fuck did you let them do this to you? You look wild, my boy. Take that shit off. Go back home. Go back home and change. Try again. No fucking thank you. Next, we got Tracy Ellis Ross in Sport Max. I like this. I, it's not really saying like red carpet. This more so look like, you know, like a, a press run, press tour sort of fit. But it's cute. You look happy. You look like you're feeling yourself, and that's what that's what makes this outfit work for me. I like it. Thank you for coming. Beautiful. Joy Sunday. I enjoyed this on a Monday. This was nice. I like this. It's it's cute. Can't go wrong with an all white look on a melanated skin. Can't do can't beat it. Ain't nothing like it. You look great. You look fabulous. Thank you for coming. Jessica Chastain looks awesome. I love this color. I love this fucking color with the shimmy and the shake at the bottom. Come on, you little Gucci fit. Only thing, I'm not really particularly happy with her hair choice. I wouldn't have chose that. I feel like it's kind of fighting with the, the dresses and all of that for me. But either way, you look beautiful. Dress is great. Thank you for coming. So all in all, the carpet was all over the place. It was left, right, up, down, in center, diagonal. Triangle, triangle, space bar, space bar, fucking out of space, fucking the core of herb to fucking what the fuck land. Like we had a fucking journey. Did I agree? No, but I appreciate. Mm, until next carpet, deuces.